In this video, we'll talk about a rapid urease test for detecting Helicobacter pylori in a person's stomach. So half of the world population has Helicobacter pylori in their stomach and many cases Helicobacter pylori can lead to serious gastric complication. In this video, we'll try to understand how this test really works. So it's a rapid urease test. That means it's a simple and rapid test. And in this test, the decision is made by color changing. So it's pretty much visual. Let me tell you how. So first of all, your doctor uh, using endoscopy takes out a small portion or a biopsy of your mucosa from your stomach antrum. Then it is transferred to a test strip. And in this test strip, there is a zone which forms a color. Now, if the color is actually red, that means Helicobacter pylori is present. And if the color is yellow, that means Helicobacter pylori is absent. And the test is negative. So let's try to understand what is the basis of this color change and why the color is changing and what does it tell us? So here is how the test is performed. The biopsy sample is provided into the desired region. Generally, the test strip should have a yellowish patch on that. And if the test is positive, then the color would change. This yellow patch should generally contain urea. In a moment, it would be clear. So this particular patch has a particular pH indicator, which is known as phenol red. When it is near to neutral, the color is yellow. That is why generally the color of that strip is yellow. But when the media turns into a basic situation and pH rise up, then the color becomes reddish. And that's what happens in Helicobacter pylori infection. So in the test strip, when you see a red color, that means positive result, you see the bacteria is present. This bacteria actually produce one enzyme, which is known as urease, that can convert urea into ammonia. Ammonia is kind of basic. That is why whenever the bacteria is present, urease enzyme is present and urea gets converted into ammonia. That is why the color is turned into red and that means the test is positive. In contrast, when the Helicobacter pylori is not present, urease enzyme is not present, so urea is not getting converted into ammonia. So it's kind of like in a neutral stage. That's why the test is now negative and that's why you see a yellow patch, not a red patch. But let us try to understand the false positive result. Sometimes you see this red color formation but it does not always ensure that your test result is positive because if you are consuming a drug which reduces the acidity of the stomach and that can possibly contribute to the false positive result because then the mucosal uh, biopsy would have an alkaline kind of situation that converts the color in this particular test strip into reddish situation which is indicative of a positive test result but in this case it's a false positive result hope you liked our video share this information with your loved ones and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you